everyone welcome back to another video today i am here to share my favorites for 2021 i think i'm gonna break it down into categories this video will be really really long so today i'm going to focus on uh skincare and makeup and this is not everything because like i said i didn't want this video to be really really long but i did grab like my main main favorites i have a lot of favorites but like i said i just grabbed enough to share with you all my favorites for 2021 you here to see what i've been loving for 2021 then y'all know what y'all need to do y'all need to click on my subscribe button because it really really helps out my channel so with that being said we're gonna jump straight into this here favorites before i jump into this favorites y'all i just want to um you must put me on something because now i receive little gifts from gucci every once in a while and i was just like really g like oh my goodness i guess all that shopping paid off I me mean, this really nice card and it's just like saying that they are we are pleased to share with you the enclosed retro cassette tape which includes a usb stick featuring a special musical journey and blah 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 if i need help with any other new items just give gucci a call and i was just like wow that is just i feel so special you all like of course y'all know i don't spend a whole whole lot of money but the money i have spent i guess it was enough for them to put me on their little um gift list or whatever you want to call it How cute this is because at first i was like a usb in the inside so what you do is you pull this out and you stick it in to your computer tv or whatever I'm able to get it to work because itunes had popped up i ended up scanning this qr code and it was like a short little video introducing this new collection so again i know gucci is not watching but thank you gucci because it's really it means a whole lot to me because little things like this i appreciate I just thought that was nice. It says, listen with love, happy holidays. This was part of their Christmas collection or whatever. I guess, I don't know why, but for some reason I just got it. I got it yesterday and of course we know Christmas is over, but I'm still happy. I don't care if it, if it would have came during the summertime. Thank you, Gucci. Let me tell you, today is snowing. <laughs> I was supposed to work today, but I was like, oh no. Your girl is not going out in that snow but yeah it's snowing like it looks so pretty outside i probably insert a picture of me t i took a picture outside on my balcony with my winter coat on and everything so i probably will try and insert some pictures of how the snow looks here it's really pretty it's not like back home snow but it's pretty i'm gonna do skincare first because that's what's in this hair bucket well not bucket in this little basket i didn't I never took this off yet. Let me go ahead and just take this here off. Here is the, this here is by the Inky List. I did get this in my training products, you all. And this is a really, really good, good cleanser. Um, it's a brightening cleans cleanser and it also helps to remove makeup. If you're wearing makeup, you can still use this cleanser. Mentioning this cleanser is because it's affordable, like it's on the drugstore. Like it's, it's like drugstore prices, but it's a really really good cleanser PM or pm gently massage a small amount into damp face dampen face eyes and neck rinse thoroughly with water and this if i didn't mention the inculus is a clean like an all clean brand so if you're looking for something to put on your face and you don't want to spend a lot of money i highly recommend the inculus and this here is sold at sephora so yeah i'm sure y'all already probably know about this if y'all do already know leave down below what y'all use from this particular brand but like i said so far so good so yeah you all oh my gosh i am so happy i repurchased this because i had this back when i was in covington and i don't know why i took it back because i don't think i tried it but i ended up taking it back and i don't know what made me repurchase this but y'all when i tell you this hair eye makeup remover so much you i don't know why i took it back back when i purchased it a long time ago but i am so glad i repurchased this because it's not that expensive something i can see me repurchasing um like i said before i don't wear a full face of makeup i just wear eye makeup like from the nose up and when i come home at night i just take like a little cotton swab and i'll dab a few drops of that on the cotton swab and when i tell you it takes my makeup completely off let me just tell you i love this stuff so if you wear makeup eye makeup like myself 
it's really good whereas though it gets off like that stubborn makeup like that waterproof makeup takes it completely off and you don't even have to use that much so this hair i will be repurchasing this it's a favorite of mine for 2021 and it's gonna be an all-time favorite of mine on to my next favorite y'all know glow recipe hands hands down my all-time favorite makeup remover i i love this because when i wear a full face i'll use this to take like all my makeup off the scoop with the little spatula I put a little water in my hands rub it you know rub it and put it all over my face and when i tell you it melts my makeup off like it melts my makeup off i was using this for my eye makeup but i just felt like it was really wasteful because this hair is not cheap this is why i ended up purchasing this because when i wear eye makeup i feel like i was just wasting the the product so when i wear a full face of makeup like today i will use this to take off all my makeup but when i wear my eye makeup to work this is what i use but y'all i love this so much as you can see this hair is empty I did repurchase one and I'm kind of like halfway on the new uh, new jar. What I do is clean everything out and use this for something. I don't know what, but I'm sure I can find something to use this for. So if y'all haven't tried the uh, Glow Recipe um, Melting Balm, I'm telling you all, you will really, really love it. And they also have a lot of other things from their collection that I love as well. But yeah, you all, this hair has been an all-time favorite of mine. Moving on to another Glow Recipe item, y'all. When I tell you I love Glow Recipe, this here is the Glow Recipe Watermelon um, Lotion. I discovered this at work because, um, you know, I wash my hands a lot. So when I come back from washing my hands, I'll go and grab like a body lotion. Like I've been using the um, Fenty Lotion, which I really like one i don't know when i tried it i was like okay this might be like one of them cheapy type of watermelon scents oh my gosh you all it smells amazing like i love this hair lotion so so much that i ended up purchasing my own i think i purchased this during the um sephora um uh, vib sale i'm telling you this is the bomb so if you go into sephora use some and it also moisturize your hands like you know when you constantly washing your hands eventually dry out and this here oh my gosh you all my favorite for 2021 you know what since it's glow recipe let me keep on going y'all this here is the glow recipe gentle cleanser is the is the blueberry bounce gentle cleanser we have the small version of this I am going to repurchase the bigger size because when I tell you using this and then using this, my whole face is just beautiful. Like, I don't know what's in these things, but it makes my skin so soft and so beautiful, you all. It's gone. So, like I said, I will be repurchasing the bigger size, but anytime I purchase things, I like to get something for something. Like I said, when I catch another sale, I am definitely repurchasing this, and this here is so good. I'm going to try and link everything down below for you all just in case you want to check out my favorites and purchase for yourself on to my next item this also was given to us in our training products which is the fenty um uh cleanser and this also removes makeup i love cleansers that uh can do more than one thing and this hair also removes makeup not that i wear makeup all the time but i like the fact that i have cleansers that can like i said do both this is why i wasn't in a rush to purchase repurchase this because i do have the fenty cleanser and i also have the inkless the inkless cleanser so this is why i didn't like need to purchase it because i do have some backups really good cleanser if you don't wear makeup it's still a good cleanser and all you do is twist this top squeeze a little bit and let me tell you a little goes a long way because when i first tried the product i pour i put too much in my hand and on my face let's just say so you only need like a dime size of this and take some water to activate the the suziness and i'm telling you all you need is a dime piece to take off a full face of makeup i'm telling you 
a little goes a long way so you all this is also another favorite of mine for 2021 moving on to my next item you all this hair is by ola hendrickson and oh my goodness you all ended up buying two of the items i'm gonna have to pull out both because these here are both my favorites they both came in a set that was on sale and i did try a sample of this at work like oh my gosh when this go on sale i'm gonna get it and it's like a uh, let me talk about this for it's like a scrub like a body scrub they got the little scrubby beads oh my goodness you all my face my face was super soft like oh my goodness and when i tried it before i brought it i was like oh my gosh i gotta get it like i gotta buy it like i said before i don't buy a lot of skincare items but since i'm getting a lot of stuff and training products i'm starting to starting to look into skincare a little more want to really deep cleanse your skin you all i highly 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 recommend this and this here is what goes along with this like once you use this you can use this afterwards smell it smells so refreshing like oh my goodness it goes along with this, with this here banana brightening all three and then this but i'll share that in a minute you all i think i got this for i don't know if i forgot the price you all but i'm telling you buy this uh, if you want super super soft skin get these two i think they come in a set because i did buy this in a set so yeah these these two come in a set you all i'm telling you buy it and i'm gonna show you one more time because oh my goodness these two together are amazing <laughs> amazing moving on to this this here is the by ola hendrickson the banana brightening vi vitamin c serum and i use this under my mask when i don't wear makeup because i like to treat my skin even though i'm not wearing a full face it brightens and it makes my face feel so nice and then it also gives you that that orange smell that just it's just a pleasant smell you all and it has a pump uh to it you i love it like around my face area and then i go in with a under eye um um cream for my under eyes my under eye area so this is also a favorite of mine on to another item this here is by dove and this here is a um exfoliating body polish I like to like i said exfoliate my face so i also like to exfoliate my body and when i get my wax down there i also use this and let me just tell you <laughs> it makes my skin so soft like oh my goodness like when i touch my skin after i use this especially like if i'm shaving my legs or my underarms like i said i go in right after this to like really scrub anything left over or whatever my legs are super soft my underarms are super soft like i use this every day because i like my body to be super soft and then it also smells good you all to look into repurchasing another one because of the fact that I am almost out. I think this is my second uh, repurchase. So yeah, you all, this hair is also a favorite of mine. Moving on to my, oh my gosh, my hands down, my favorite. Like if this ever come in a beauty set, I am buying it. Like I am buying this. I done brought an extra one. This is how much I love this. And I hope this is not one of those scents that's, um addition because you know how that go when you love something then you look and it's gone i like the original scent but this one i like a lot better like if i had a, if i had to choose i would choose this over the original scent maybe because i had i smelled that scent for so long and when they came out with this oh my gosh you all i i fell in love like when people come in to purchase the bum bum cream i always say did you smell anita you gotta smell it and they be like oh my gosh give me one and i'm like i'm telling you you all like it's good i recommend every time they always purchase because it's the bomb so if you never smell anita i'm telling you smell it and if you did smell it let them know down below how good she is like she's the bomb you all the bomb to spray this when i get out the shower because i like to smell delicious if you get what i'm saying it doesn't last long like a perfume so don't look for this to like last all day but it lasts long enough because uh one time i uh before i went to the doctor i used um, the bum bum cream and this and the lady was like oh my gosh what do you have on and i was because she was weighing me on the um scale and then when she was doing my blood um 
my blood pressure she was up close to me and she was like oh my goodness you smell so good what do you have on and i told her what it was she was like oh my gosh i'm gonna order that as soon as i get off of work and i was like yeah because it's good like that so now moving on to my last two items and this here is by tatcha and y'all already know how i feel about my lip products this here is one of the tatcha lip lip balms or um I don't know lip whatever lip gels or lip something oh my goodness you all i love it i love it i love it and as you can see we are almost gone when we went to disney so i had it for a while and i use this every morning every night when i get out the shower it comes with like it comes with a gold spatula i you like i said i use this every morning and every night all the time this is my everyday lip balm tatcha and this one here is by laneige this one i'll use like throughout the day it has a little applicator that you just push in the inside of this hair top which i like because you don't have to worry about the applicator just hanging around now with this one the applicator do hang around and what i do is i usually leave it on the top of this once i wipe it off from using it, it sits by my nightstand because i use this one like i said throughout the day on my lips like i just don't and y'all, I love this one as well. Like I said, this is by Laneige. So I will link that down below. <sighs> Let me take a break. That was everything for a skincare. Now, one of my lights done went out. So I am going to have to find the charger so I can charge her up. And I call myself um, charging the batteries uh, beforehand. So let me find the plug and I'll be right back okay so i was able to flick the light back on so hopefully fingers crossed it stays on so now we're going to move on to my makeup side okay it's not in my lights because like i said the battery was um the batteries went out so i pulled like i said some makeup this is not everything but like i stated at the beginning of the video i didn't want this uh particular video to be really really long so I probably just share the things that I didn't share in this video. I probably would do more of a monthly type of thing as far as my favorites. Starting off with um, the foundation. This here is by Sephora. Uh, best skin ever. And when I tell you, you all, I love this foundation so much. I ended up trading one of my uh, training products with um, one of my Sephora friends and she gave me this and oh my gosh you are I love it Like I would have never thought to buy a Sephora foundation like, Nothing wrong with the Sephora foundation, but I just was never checking for it So when you know, I had the opportunity to switch something that I knew I wasn't going to use I was like, okay and y'all, I love it so much. And like I said before, the way I determine a foundation is how it looks on camera. I determine um, my foundations is how it looks when I take pictures and again when I film. So yeah, you all, this here is my favorite. And you wanted to use me for reference, this here is in the color 35N. Moving on to my next item. This here is my um, Hydro Grip milk setting spray this is what i use today again i love this and i also love the um primer so yeah you all this here is a favorite of mine this here is by milk makeup this here is the hydro setting spray I saw that video i ended up purchasing this and i did get the big size they do have smaller sizes but it's like go big or go home so yeah i got that and that's also a favorite of mine and with milk i ended up getting the milk grip primer of course y'all already know if y'all into makeup already aware of the milk um hydro grip primer i love it a whole lot now the key to using this you do you do have to let it sit for a few seconds and again they told us you know they told us that in training so yeah anytime you put primers on you want to let them sit for a few seconds just to let them do what they need to do so yeah you all this here is also a favorite of mine and this one i raved about before i'm sure y'all already know this here is the anastasia anastasia or anastasia uh, beverly hills foundation y'all this here was my favorite before the um sephora this is the one that i was using all the time in my videos because i just love the way it looked on me when i was going back to when i was going back to editing my videos i was like okay i like this foundation it's in the color 430w 
and y'all i love this hair foundation i will be repurchasing this if i'm no if i don't fall in love with something else so yeah this is also a good one and this hair elf y'all i love my elf eyeshadows like i'm telling you elf is so affordable but they pack a punch elf um palettes i don't even have to spray with water that's how good they are and these here are so much cheaper than the expensive ones i use that i have to spray with water like some of these here elf shadows i do not have to spray with water and this is the one that i use for like a no makeup makeup look and i did get this from uh tj maxx 99 so yeah this is the one i use when i don't want to have like a a bold eye look so yeah you all this here is also a favorite elf these here are the shadows that i'm talking about that you don't need to put water on putting water on them but you do not need water for these and these here are like 2.99 like you can get these at ulta walmart um and target you if you don't want to spend that sephora money for eye makeup i'm telling you get one of these uh 2.99 shadows and you will thank me later and if i didn't mention this hair is in the color rose water and sticking with eyeshadows i did just buy this you all Too Faced uh kitty likes to scratch when i tell you anytime i create a look from this i get so many compliments on my particular look guys i get so many people at work um, like oh my gosh Tamika because they always compliment my eyes because you know I'm always coming in with something cute and over the top and it was like oh my gosh Tamika what you use what you use this is what I use and I got mine from the cosmetic company store I try and look I try and use eyeshadow palettes that we sell in Sephora and people will come in and be like oh my gosh I love your eyeshadow what you wear so I try and use Sephora brand, but if I can't, you know, it is what it is. But y'all, I had got so many compliments on this hair shadow, this hair palette. I think I'm gonna probably try and create a look with this when I do a makeup review. It's also a favorite. And y'all know, this is my Ride or Die LA Girl Pro Concealer, y'all. Hands down, favorite, 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 favorite. Brands came out with like that pumpkin um concealer and all of those mm -mm. your girl is not paying all that money for that i stick with what works and it's the la girl pro concealer my aunt just told me she bought a lot of these because they are like 2.99 love them now these this particular color you can't wear by itself you have to put makeup on top of it you have some that you can wear by itself but this one you do have to put makeup on top of it just so you know how to use it this is more of a color corrector now my all-time all-time favorite like this has been my favorite since Covington so if you are oldie but goodie and you watch any of my makeup tutorials back then y'all already know how I swear by this on to my next item this was given to us in our training products and this here is the Sephora uh, foundation brush and before I before using brushes y'all know I love my sponge my beauty blender uh, type sponges I got this in my training products I love this brush so much i see why it's sephora's number one foundation brush i mentioned this here is in the color in the color this here is in the number 56 y'all i just i dab see what i do is i put foundation on my hands and i'll take it and then i'll dab it all over and then i'll go behind with the sponge only because if i put on too much foundation the sponge will help even it out and soak some of it up. So yeah, that's how I apply. That's how I apply my uh, foundation, just in case I, you know, put too much on. So yeah, you all, this here is a favorite. Moving on to my next favorite. This here is the Kiss. This here is the Kiss Lash Glue. And y'all, if you struggle with putting lashes on, get this because all you do is put it across your, um, take it and put it across your eye. And you can put the lash right on like maybe let it sit for like two seconds and you can apply your lash on when I tell you that baby don't move it don't move like my hair don't move like that's what this this don't move <laughs> you can get this at Ulta Walmart and Target as well a favorite favorite I think this is like ten dollars but it's worth it you all and then us and this is also another favorite i did just purchase this not too long ago but i purchased this because i wanted something for my lower lashes and when i tell you i love the brush on this particular item 
it gets all up in the groove of my little like lower lashes this is for is my lower lashes i'm sure if you you know use it with your regular lashes it really will pull them out i just don't wear my regular lashes as often so i just mainly purchase this for my lower lashes because but you all this here is a really good mascara i think this is by madison addison or addison madison i don't know she's some she's some type of uh tiktoker famous person but i just like what i like so yeah a good lip gloss oh my goodness this hair is so bomb and it smells so good like i know people are sensitive to um smells but i love a gloss that has like a fruity smell like i'm just that person and it just makes your lips pop like if you don't wear lipstick or lip liners or anything like this this here is a really good um lip gloss and this here i love so much and this one here is in the color um come through so yeah this is really really good moving on to my next item this here is by benefit this is the benefit um brow setter and i use this with my brows because when i apply my brows in the morning that's what i struggle with and i am looking to treat myself to maybe getting my eyebrows microbladed because i spend a lot of time doing my eyebrows and i struggle with my eyebrows i mean sometimes they look some days they look better than other days really struggle with my eyebrows so i was like maybe i should treat myself to you know getting them microbladed whereas though i don't have to worry about you know fussing with them every morning because i do do my brows every day because without if your brows not right your whole face it just throw your whole look off it helps to keep my eyebrows in place you all this is my favorite on to my next favorite are the Fenty glosses. I do have before I put on that before I put on this lip gloss, I do have the new Fenty lip gloss on, which is the lemon lava or whatever. So I just wanted to mention all her glosses because y'all I love all her glosses. Anytime she come out with a gloss, I'm on it. Like on it, on it, on it. I love her glosses. And he by Fenty are the newest um glosses and oh my gosh you all hands down my favorite until my next favorite this here is by one size i did repurchase this because we did get this in our training products and i ended up liking it so much so i purchased a, a backup use this every time i put on my eye makeup if i don't put this on so yeah it doesn't like smear or get messy around your eyes you all this hair is also a favorite to my almost last item this here is by summer fridays my first time ever purchasing from this brand and i do use this every day at work because i like to keep my lips moisturized at work because even though i wear a mask i have to keep my lips hydrated because sometimes they get dry and i don't like to wear lip gloss i mean lipsticks or matte lipsticks I mainly keep like a good lip balm in my pocket like my Laneige or something like this and this is this is something that I just purchased not too long ago <laughs> love it so much like I said it smells nice it reminds you of the bite beauty uh, sleeping mask but yeah you are this is what I uh, keep in my um, sweater pocket to use every day I'll show you my last item this is the new heat by Fenty like I said, it's a pretty gloss. It has like gold shimmers in it. I just love it, you all. I just love anything Fenty. Like, I am a Fenty girl. Last but not least, you all, hands down, my all-time favorite forever and ever lip liner um, by Sephora. We haven't gotten these in because as soon as they come in, I am purchasing another one and another one and another one. Who is in the number 17, you all, when I tell you i love this because i'll put this on with like a light lipstick and then i'll cover my lips with like a popping gloss i wear this by itself because it's really really creamy i like the fact that it's not drying on my lips was my last item but i just purchased the norris um new foundation in the color medium deep cadiz y'all let me know what y'all think this is what i'm wearing today and so far so good i will have to look at my footage to really know if it looks good but y'all i heard this had like a lot of skin benefits like, oh my goodness a couple of us at sephora we was like we can't wait to try this so i think i'm the first one to purchase 
the Norris foundation so I'll let them know how I like it but like I said so far so good because I was telling my aunt about this hair foundation if I like it after this hair particular video I probably do probably do a first impressions with you all so y'all can see how it applies on my skin let's say this is a favorite um, as of yet because like I said I did just purchase it but I'm just mentioning it in this video so I'll know uh, what, what video I wore this in and it's in my favorite so yeah you all and let me just show you the packaging it looks like the regular foundation packaging but it's a little different for the bottle so yeah I remember trying to buy that matte foundation by Norris and I just had a hard time with uh, finding a shade to match and this one matches me really really nice oh my gosh you all this snow out here looks so beautiful i'm going back outside and take some more pictures with that being said you all that is everything that i've been loving for 2021 i probably would do another video on my most used handbags or whatever i do have some unboxings coming up so make sure you are subscribed out on those upcoming videos and I just want to say thank you to my old subscribers and my newcomers I appreciate you all taking the time to watch my videos thousands and thousands of videos out there that could be watching and I appreciate the time to watch your girl because it really helps me out so with that being said you all give a big thumbs up because it helps out my channel and vacation bell so y'all can be notified each week when your girl uploads videos and until next time and there will be a next time. I will talk to you later. Bye.